What is up, my Mardi Gras crew? I'm back with another banger for you. Yes, I am, y'all. And today, I'm doing a challenge. Let's say grace. Heavenly Father, thank you for this food that we nourish to my body. In Jesus' name we pray. And Lord, bless those around us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with everybody you know so we can get this channel up there, okay? Make sure you subscribe and watch till the end, guys. All right, so this challenge is originally by Lips. I think it came out like a year ago or so or two that Sam said. So I was challenged by Sam's world, my girl, with her beautiful self. All right, she challenged me to do this challenge where you do five pancakes and five wings, um, pancakes uh, from IHOP. <laughs> but these are from McDonald's because I could not get to IHOP. All right, so uh, let's get everything together. I wanna put a little more butter on these. And there's no time limit. You just have to eat it all. And that's what I'm gonna do for you guys. Um, hold on, y'all. Okay, yeah. All right. Okay. Put this to the side because I want to pour some syrup on here and try to get a thumbnail. Okay. Okay, I believe you jump in the line. All right. Hmm. Yeah, I'm starving. Just came from church. Got some good gravy today. I don't know if that's a country thing or like a southern thing when you, the older generation used to say, uh, we had some good gravy today. Y'all ever heard that before? <laughs> we had some good gravy, meaning we had good church. We were fed. <clears throat> I'm not a pancake person. I am a waffle person. But I'm doing it. I wanted to eat that one time slice of sauce with this chicken. But I didn't know how it would pair with um with the um Pancake. Mm. I have honey, mustard, and ketchup back here for dipping.
When I went to Popeye's, <clears throat> I got the like the family meal, whatever, which is like 24 pieces of chicken and um, two large sides, seven biscuits. When I placed the order, I told the lady, you know, out of the 14 pieces, I need five of those pieces to be wings, right? She even called it back to me and said, you want blah, 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 five pieces to be wings, right? I'm like, yes, ma'am. <laughs> Get my order. She gave me nine wings. No, no breasts, which are my favorite. <laughs> the rest were legs and thighs. I'm like, ugh. I have some eaters here, living here. So I need those big pieces to fill people up. This chicken is dang near gone. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to say something, but when I checked my order, I pulled up. So I would have had to get back in line because the inside is closed, all of that. Um, but um, I forgot what I was say. But yeah. I was really disappointed in that. This is good.
This would be so good if this were waffles. I mean, it's good, <laughs> but it would be even better if these were waffles. <clears throat> Are you guys done with your uh, Christmas shopping? Are you all done? I'm getting full of these pancakes. But yeah. Are you guys done with your Christmas shopping? Or, um, and do you buy for kids, just kids or kids and adults? Mm. Because this year, This year, I'm hearing a lot of people say they're not buying for adults. Every year I buy for kids and adults. But I said next year, I'm only buying for adults who get me things. Because every year, I have a few family members who, they get my kids something, but they don't get me anything and I get them something. And it's not like, it's not like this is, like it was just last year I bought them something. Every year, I buy something for everybody. But yeah, I told myself this year, if, If an adult doesn't buy me anything, they're not getting anything. Unless you don't have kids. If you don't have kids and you buy for my kid, I'm gonna get you something. But if you, if you have kids or a kid and I bought you something and you didn't buy me nothing, I'm buying the kids something. So, so this is my last year buying everybody something. Mm-hmm.
and I know it's not about um it's not about the gift it's just about the the joy of the holidays and everything but I put a lot of thought into my gifts like I'm not the type that I just buy you a gift like I actually think about what I see you eating or what I see you doing Yeah, I put a lot of thought into my gifts. Like my sister, every year we know we're getting candles or soaps from Bath and Body Works. <laughs> oh wait, no, not Bath and Body Works. Bed Bath and Beyond. No, Bed, Bath and Body Works. Which is cool because you know you need that for your house. <laughs> but... Me, I, like I said, I actually think about what you like and I buy you something different based on what you like. I pay attention. And I think people really appreciate that. When you buy them something and they actually like the gift because it's, a, it's something that matches their energy or whatever. So let me know what you guys think about that and if you're finished your Christmas shopping. This was really good. I'm full. It was the pancakes. So, if you have not done this challenge, I want you to go ahead and do this challenge. Um, try and think who I can challenge. Because I don't know who, who did this already because it was so long ago. I, I think it was before I started YouTube. Because um, I think it was like a year or two ago. Um, so, I am going to challenge uh, Bayou Kitchen Guy. Um, Marquise. Um, I'm going to challenge TMV Nation. I, I'm just challenging y'all. <laughs> Who else? I don't know. I'm going to challenge. Hmm. I don't know. But if you haven't done this challenge, I challenge you. All right, guys. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this video because it was delicious, even though it went better with waffles. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Before you click off this video, you need to hit subscribe, y'all. I appreciate you. Make sure you check out some more of my content, like the uh, eating uh, the 20 chicken legs and all of that good stuff. Love you guys. See you next video. Peace.